All right, my fourth piece of practical advice for consistent creativity is to ignore everybody. It's going to feel you're going to feel selfish, selfish, you're going to feel like, you know, you're you're just ignoring everybody and neglecting everything and everyone, but you really have to sort of maybe close the door, do something where you are taking your time uh very sacredly because our creativity, our creative time really is sacred. And yes, you may have family, you may have friends, you may have pets, but you do have to kind of ignore them sometimes and you have to just go into your space, show up basically and get to work. And yeah, I don't neglect those people because you don't want to be selfish all the time. But, you know, to be creative, we have to sort of sequester ourselves, maybe not lock ourselves away in the studio for months or years at a time. But we need to ignore people for a little while at least. So if you can schedule time, maybe it's a time when your spouse isn't around. Maybe it's right after you feed the dogs, some time where you can sort of close yourself away and just be by yourself and be creative. So yeah, sometimes you have to ignore everybody, but be careful that you don't neglect them. So ignore everybody and get to work.